What's really exciting, I just started doing digital artworks, which is all on computer. And it's, it's really fabulous because they have a lot of different colors to use, a lot of different textures, which are industrial and, and you know, 10 different types and sizes of paintbrushes and backgrounds. And it, it, so I've done like a couple of UFO paintings, which show like an interstellar background. And the nice part about it is you could erase, if you don't like something that a color you put up or a shape or a, a little design, you could erase it and say, okay, I want to do something different, which is really you can't do when you're painting, you don't have a giant eraser if you're using a, a paintbrush. Um, so it's really cool and you get a 3D effect and it's just really fun to, to uh, experiment with all the different colors and shapes and these uh textures that are you know uh, you 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 could put in the middle across uh, underneath the painting uh, to make it look uh, they really look cool um that you really it's hard to do on either a glass painting or a canvas painting because you can't erase it and you don't know how it's going to look in your mind so yeah i can put that design on this canvas but once you put it you can't erase it you can paint over it which usually make a mess this you just erase and then you could try a different shape well, the same shape but a different color it's really cool and you know it's uh kind of more interstellarish or for me anyway because it has so many different it has little clouds and things like splashes that are already done so you just, oh, I want to put a little paint splash there. And that particular color, so you pick a color, boom, you splash. Or it has like a little Z or a, um, a, it looks like a little uh, snail crawling across the painting. Uh, that it's like, you know, wow, that looks really cool. And you put whatever color you want to put on there or take it off. Now, once you go on to the next thing, you can't erase it. And so it's. You have to finish whatever you're working on at that time. But I did so many interstellar ones that like are on the glass, but on computer. And they come out really cool. They're fun. And they're on the website. So I got four or five, maybe six already up. And uh, I'm still experimenting with those. So, you know, you, you use one item and you say, oh, I'm going to use that in the background on the next one. Um, so it's a learning process. Um, the first one I did, I, I think is the best one I did. It was just, I was just experimenting. I mean, oh, wow, that came out really nice. <laughs> so, and the, the cool part is you could take any one of those digital paintings and blow it up on our, our site, 24 by 36 inches. So you can have a nice big picture of this digital artwork available uh, on the website. You just, you know, pick out which one you want and, blow it up on canvas, on real canvas and paint. So it's pretty cool. Well, that concludes our video for today. Um, our little artist heart 